Morning guys, it is Wednesday morning and I just finished getting ready for work and I'm gonna try to get a little Instagram picture before I leave because the lighting in my house seems to be better in the morning than at night. So I'm gonna attempt to get a photo. Last week I tried to do this before work and I was dripping sweat head to toe because I was trying to take those like trendy mirror pictures. Like you take a mirror like this and like move it around your house or take it outside or something like that i tried outside i tried in my kitchen i tried everywhere and it was horrible literally i swear my underwear was showing in most of them or i was sweating or my eyes were closed like <laughs> you guys if you could see the photos it's honestly so embarrassing so i think i'm gonna just you know stick to the what i know and try to get a cute one for instagram so that's what i'm doing this morning Okay, anyways, this is what I'm wearing to work today. So I have this bodysuit on that is from Free People. I have these bigger hoops on from Madewell and these little star earrings from uh, Cupcakes and Cashmere. And then I just have them on with these like cropped high-waisted jeans from Madewell. So that is what I'm wearing today. And just to let you guys know, all those photos sucked and you will not be seeing any of them so happy wednesday hey guys so i forgot lunch today so i ran and got something i picked up roti which is one of my favorite things um i'm not sure how popular they are but um it's basically like chipotle but mediterranean food so i got a chicken rice plate so it has chicken rice lettuce feta olives cucumbers pickles and you basically just get to like walk through the line and order it so it's really quick and it's so good there's not a ton around here so i don't get it as often as i would like but um it is so so good anyways today is super nice out i feel like for spring we've had the hottest weather ever it's 86 here and for minnesota that's crazy so and we're not even are we are in the middle of june now but usually it doesn't get that warm until like august i feel like maybe i don't know it just seems super warm recently um so that's been kind of nice i've been craving traveling so bad i think it's just because i know i can't and one of our trips was canceled so i'm just like thinking about it more but i just like want to get the h out of minnesota which i know like everyone else feels like that like just like kind of feels trapped i don't know but how have you guys been doing i know a lot of places are like opening up and becoming a little bit more um loose with their restrictions and stuff um are you guys feeling comfortable like going out to dinner or do you still like stay home for the most part i've been going into work now for probably like four weeks so kind of once i started having to do that i feel like it seems a lot more normal like my schedule and stuff but obviously not going out as often but we have gone out like once i think maybe but we do plan on going out this weekend which i'm kind of excited about we'll be smart we'll wear our masks and do all the social distancing stuff that we have to but i don't know i feel like it's just starting to feel like a little bit more normal and i know that the virus isn't gone but huh. how do you guys feel about it i'm gonna finish eating go back to work and i'll check in with you guys in a little bit i'm done with her well, what was that word I'm done with work now and David and I are actually going to run into Ikea. Um, he was going to do it earlier today but the thing that I want doesn't fit in his car so I am here to pick it up which I'm not too sad about because I kind of wanted to walk around and look there anyways. So yeah let's head in to Ikea, put our mask on. Here we go. These are like super nice and they're like under $20. I like what these feel like. They just throw a blanket. Yeah. 
This rainbow one's actually cute. But just not my vibe. I like it drawn to anything with this light wood color right now. I think it's just it's so pretty. I just don't think I need it. Okay, something about these I think are so cute. They're like little glass bananas. Do you like this or is it too weird? <laughs> Maybe it's a little bright. I really like this picture, but I don't love the blue, but I could always paint it. I do like this one too, which is cute. I've never noticed that they had wrapping paper here, so I'm gonna get some black some craft paper and then they have these really cute tags these are just things I like to have all the time so I'm gonna get some of those all right we just finished going through the whole like showroom we didn't get a ton but now we're gonna go try to find the actual shelving unit that we came for in the like warehouse section do you love Ikea? at times <laughs> We're home from Ikea now, and I'll show you guys what I got in a little bit. But David got done with work early and made guac and pico, pico, which and sounds both, so good. They smell delicious. Yeah. Let's see how they are. We're gonna make um, quesadillas for dinner, so we're having a little Mexican night. Throw me a chip. There's just so much guac. Mm hmm. It's pretty good. Do you think it needs anything else in it? No, I think it's good. So mm. I didn't capture the uh, guac making process on camera. That is so good. Is it? I like the pico better than the guac. Yeah. This is one of the things that I got when I went to Ikea, which if you know me, you are probably really confused because I don't really like chocolate, but Zoe Sugg talked about these on her blog, I don't know, a couple months ago, so I just tried them. They're so good. It's like chocolate covered toffee, essentially. It says like caramel almonds candy, but kind of just tastes like a toffee to me, and they are so good. This is my second bag, and I brought some to work, and all my coworkers like it. So I bought another bag to share with them. And yeah, so if you have an IKEA near you, or I'm sure they're on Amazon, these are super good. And then besides my shelf, I got some of that wrapping paper that I showed when we were there, and then this. Just got that little rug to go by our front door because we didn't have one. So yeah, that's all I got at Ikea, nothing too crazy, but now I'm gonna prep for dinner.
am going to paint my nails tonight. I've been meaning to do that since literally last week and it's just one of those things I was like putting off. But I got a new color by Essie and it's in the color Marshmallow. It is super light. It almost looks white until you put it next to white. Um, so I thought it'd be kind of cool if I put my white stars, these stickers that I got um, at Target. I did another manicure with this with like a color similar to this candle and they looked really cool. So I had a vision of like doing this like off whitey marshmallow color and then putting the white stars on top. But part of me is like, is this gonna be a waste of time because no one will be able to even see the stars? I feel like I have to get my nails painted and then like put it up to see if you can even tell because I'm not gonna go through all that and then no one even noticed that I have stars on my fingers. So the first thing I'm gonna do is file my nails and then like buff them which there is nothing worse in the world than files you guys i cannot stand the like sound the feeling like at, when i get my nails done at a salon i literally have goosebumps everywhere on my body because it literally grosses me out so much but if i don't file these they're just gonna look like trash so i'm gonna suck it up file them so they look nice but literally there's nothing worse Oh god. Um, I'm also gonna just like share a different shit with you guys. Like I really just wanna so this is like my bag today. And I because I feel like so on, like just like this, just like I feel so on. I think calls the word I'm doing. Um like this, except oh my nose, I don't know if that's on my other side. Oh we talk about the club car macchiato because we get questions about this all the time, like, what are you drinking? What are you drinking? And I've kind of perfected it. And I have to admit, it was from, like, thanks to you guys as well, because you know. Okay, so here is the color, which is super pretty. It's very white. So now we're going to test to see if these are any different. I kind of hope they are, because it would look cool if it was, like, monochromatic. But let's see. So... Here's my nails. I think I need to do one more coat, but then I feel like we'll definitely be able to see the star. It'll be subtle, but I think it's gonna be cool. So we're gonna try it. I'm gonna start with one of the bigger stars and then just place it. I'm gonna do it on the edge here. And just use my nail to lightly press it. Okay, that's cute. Fun. Okay, I'm going to do the other nail. Okay, I had to come outside because my lighting in my house is getting pretty dark, but I think I like it. You definitely can see them, obviously it's subtle but I think it's kind of cool perfect for like the 4th of July for sure so fun all right I'm gonna end the vlog here I hope that you guys are enjoying vlog week and I will see you guys tomorrow bye